All right, here we go. This is an update uh, and over the last couple of weeks. We lost about a week to rain, so uh, we're a little bit behind. But this was about five days ago. Um, they came and formed up the footers. So what you see there in the, in the foreground is the garage, the patio to the right, and then the main living space, garage, uh, basement. Basement's going to be eight, nine foot tall poured walls. So uh, pretty nice. Now we're going to spin around towards the lake. Uh, just kind of see uh, how things are going to go. That's the the main living. That'll be like the man cavey thing with big windows. And then there's the patio and then uh, the garage. So uh, that's that's what we're doing. I'm going to show a little another view just coming uh, back, showing it from the side. So again, uh, garage is, of course, considerably higher than the, than the basement. Drops down uh, five feet for the basement uh, and the that's the stairwell. That's what the, the forms are there in the center right. Uh, so going out to the front door. And uh, and again, this is the basically the mechanical room. And there'll be a little shop down in, in the basement here. And then we will build a second bedroom and a bathroom in, in this area where it's kind of enjoyed there. Okay, so now all of a sudden we've got the footers are poured. So looking at it from the top again, the garage on the right. And then the living space to the left and the patio in the upper right. So that's the form, the footers that were all poured uh, two days ago. And uh, then, boom, uh, they put up the walls, filled the walls with concrete today. That was June 6th. So this was the video from today. So I'm just kind of coming around showing that that'll be the master patio off the master bedroom. And then that's the um, wall of windows in the in the basement. All those windows will go up. To the sec, you know, to, to the main floor as well. But here I'm going to just try to get my drone, try not to hit anything here, showing kind of the view from the basement, uh, from about about eye height. Um, so not a great view, but it's more to let in light and not have it feel like a basement than than to really see the lake. Um, then I'm gonna I'm gonna pop down here a little bit. So I, basically I got to get that grade. So that the grade's got to get below the the window there. So we have to take that whole grade down, fill it all in, and uh, and that will be. Uh, the grade then I'm going to come up here a little bit and saying all right stopping here is about eye height from the basement so yeah you'll still see trees but you're not really going to see the lake and now I'm going to go up a little bit higher what I think is going to be standing in front of the windows you know the lake is down there again we've got to thin out a lot of trees to try to make that look a little bit better uh, then I'm going to spin around and then show the the the, the footings for the the deck off the master bedroom so this will be a cedar deck uh for with a sliding glass door and so that's just the pads for the for the footers for the uh sono tubes to build the deck on so nothing too big but we poured those today then that's the wall that we'll have there'll be a second bedroom in the basement there so on this wall that i'm spinning around just trying to show there'll be a big five foot wide by three foot high escapement window so that the we can have a legal ba bathroom in that wall coming around now towards the the front of the house. And I'm showing, uh, there I am, and then there's basically the wall, and then the, the pad there to the right, that cement will hold up the, the front porch. Uh, so that's for that to be, uh, that's for the front porch. Get that below the frost line, and then there's the garage. Garage pops out about, yeah, that's four feet, so then the, the porch will come out six feet from the house. And then that's the garage. So, uh, boy, we had a lot of rain. And so that rain is just not, uh, water is just not soaking in and going away. So um, that's the that's the house as of uh, Thursday, June 6th. Uh, we're getting really close. Again, that's the patio. That'll all get filled in with sand all the way up. So house is going to sit pretty high because the garage there is going to get filled up, of course, to the top of the foundation. And so uh, we have a lot of dirt to, to put in and, and uh and backfill but it's uh, coming along nicely hopefully uh, tomorrow they'll pull the forms off we'll give it a week to dry and then they'll start building the house there's your uh, weekly update